I'm Ava. And I'm Ari. And this is Potato the Chicken. Welcome to Clearwater Kids Challenge. Clearwater Farm is where Potato lives. And this is a place where kids can explore and learn from nature. Today we're asking... Hey, Potato. What's a rubber ducky? Got to do with my tuna sandwich. Let's take a closer look at the water around us for a clue. Unlike nature, we don't filter our stormwater very efficiently. Stormwater is the water that runs down towards lakes, rivers, and oceans. Looks pretty good. For now, let's imagine that this food coloring is toxic waste. And let's say this is herbicides and pesticides, chemicals that are put on flowers, plants, and trees to keep pests away. Let's say that this is solid waste like plastics and litter. Now when it rains like it is today, the rainwater collects all this gross, toxic stuff and washes it into our sewer system. And then right into rivers, lakes, and oceans. Yuck! If an animal eats plastic then I eat the animal, then I'm eating the plastic basically that the animal ate. I've seen people like shampooing in the lake and the chemicals are bad for the fish and bad for like people who like swim in the lake as well. And we don't want dead fish in the lake. No, that's gross and sad. Plastics are especially bad for our water because they break down into tiny pieces and invisibly float around. This adds to all the gross stuff in the water. All of this bad stuff ends up in the food chain when fish, like tuna, eat it and it ends up in my sandwich. Oh, that's right, Potato. That is what a rubber duck has to do with my tuna sandwich. At the farm, we let nature do its thing, but we make it easier for nature by not using toxic chemicals that could wash down into the lake. And the forest, garden, and green spaces naturally filter water before it runs down into the lake. The earth has many ways that it purifies water. Sandy soil traps little things as water moves through it. Bacteria in soil eats and breaks down contaminants to purify water. Plant roots, including this cattail, also filter water. Hi, I'm Chase. I'm 15 and an environmental activist. Let's talk about water pollution. Avoiding water pollution is very important, and at home we use biodegradable or toxic-free chemicals in our house, and we also try to reduce whatever we put down the sink that doesn't belong there, any fats or other chemicals that shouldn't belong down the drain, we try to keep away and just put water down the drain. Challenge time! What can you do at home? We challenge you to help nature do its thing! Yeah! Use natural ingredients like vinegar and water when you help clean around the house. Or head down to your street and clean up any litter that could wash down into storm drains. For riddles, games, and lots more to explore, visit clearwaterkids.org. Be like Potato and challenge yourself to build a healthier world.